Charles to Kokoma there, oh, sitting there, always smiling all the time, you know, always has a smile on his face. He's a happy guy, man. Exactly. Yeah, Jumanji is from the USA. Yes, Ooh. that's true. Definitely made his presence known when he walked over here. He was like, yo, Steve, we in the building. I'm like, we are in the building. Got quite a few, but you got to be Round careful. One. Yeah. Yoshimitsu exactly. versus Fang. Mm. Let's see what Chicken Mario can do here. And Fang, you know, a character that he's been using a lot and goes straight for the lows there. Oh, I like, I like this already. Down 4-1. Goes instantly for the low. I like what Chicken Mario was doing right there. Yeah, I'm not sure if Jabanji should really be testing, you know, Chicken Mario's knowledge because you know he does play Kane and Trench from the UK. Mm -hmm. You know, plays a mean Yoshimitsu. You know, me and uh, Ryan Hart was talking about this though. Like characters, like specifically Yoshimitsu, Yoshimitsu, the Ninas, the Lays, mm. all those characters. They have such a specific play style that like. If you go to a different region, you can essentially be fighting a different character in yeah. some instances. So 100%. you got to play it a little more respectfully, right? Mm. And I feel like, yeah, obviously you don't want to test it, but as a Yoshimitsu player, you also have to test your opponent to see what they know. So yeah, exactly, I see what Jumanji's yeah. doing, you know? Yeah, Jumanji taking that first round, but Chicken Mario fighting back here. I wonder how well Jumanji knows, you know, Fang. From what I've seen, Jumanji's someone who studies the game, you know, he likes to look yeah. at all the frame data, likes to play by the book. See if Chicken Mario can break that defense Ooh, here. Chicken Mario, nice shoulder one round up. Yeah. Fight. Oh, nice. Oh. Down 4 2, raw launch. And okay. we saw how Jumanji was actually doing really well in that first round. Actually took advantage of it. Little 1 1 right there just to see. Nice. Oh, raw shoulder. Yeah, punishes with 1 1. Mm, we were talking about this. Oh, no, counter hit. Chicken Mario, no. Started the raw shoulder game. Oh, no, the power crush to get through. Yo, this is exactly what I'm talking yeah, about. Yeah, a a different style. Aggressive. Yeah, you know, there's many Yoshimitsu players out there. You know, you've got I Musician who's super crazy, or Kane and Trick who's mm -hmm. super passive. Uh, but Jumanji, you know, if he plays in between here, you know, it's going to be a problem for Chicken Mara. He's never faced a Yoshi like this before. Ooh, oh, yo, it's wow. adding up, though. Man, they're going round for round really fast, though. Raw shoulder, shoulder again. And, and that is what Chicken Mario is known for. You know, people don't really oh, punish the shoulder properly. Yeah, so no, he's, you know, one of the Feng players that likes throwing out the shoulder for no reason. And here, nice grab. I like the test though, just to see if you can actually mess with it or not. And no break on the throw. I think the last time, you know, Jumanji punished it with 1-1. One, one. So now Chicken Mario is more inclined to use that shoulder. Mm -hmm. Nice whiff punish as well. And it's such a good tactic. My man just standing there, yo. Chicken model, you can see the frames now. Yeah. Simple and one, two, and then the raw shoulder. Exactly. Look at, he he knows you, look at that. He points up as well. He's like, you know, little mini pop off. Good stuff by Chicken Maru. Retired Maru is his name, man. I like that. Retired yeah, Maru. Let's go, man. And look at it. He's, he's sitting there laughing. You know, this is the life of a retired player. You know, just sitting there chilling. Having a good time. Having a good talking to his boy, okay. K. Wiss. You know, he's just sitting there. He looks very, very calm. But what is Jumanji going to do to, you know, to fight back here? So if retired just means you're having a good time and your friends are coaching you, then I'll let you retire. Nice, Doesn't mean yeah. you can get away from the competitional aspect. Wait, of I don't it. know if there's allowed two. Wait. You can't do two coaches, bro. You oh, can't no, but he's speaking two. to both. So I think oh, he just okay. said okay. GG's, yeah. But no, I mean, you're right, though. I mean, obviously, um, Jumanji actually had a really good run. Took the first round, went down to the last round in that first game. Yeah. But I think with Chicken Mario, just slowly but surely, just kind of sprinkling in the elbows really Ooh. did add up. Yeah, it was really good stuff. And the use of the shoulder as well. I don't think I've seen a Feng player use the shoulder like that. You know, it's super punishable move, but throwing it out like it's, you know, like it's minus 10 or something. And if someone doesn't punish your moves properly, why would you, you, know, not? Why would you not do it? Like, you need to carry on doing it. If someone's, someone thinks something is, you know, jab punishable when it's launched, carry on doing Yo, it all the exactly. time. More resources for you. No, you're exactly right. Me and Ryan Hart was talking about it yesterday. If mm. it ain't broke, don't fix it. Yeah, exactly. If they yeah. don't give me a reason to stop doing something, mm. why would I stop doing <laughs> it if it's gonna help me win? You know. <laughs> One time I did like a, a safer minus nine move, and I let I walked forward to let them jab punish me twice. And yeah. the final round, I yeah. ducked. Exactly, exactly. That's, <laughs> that's exactly the real. What that's the real stress, bro. Right, here we go, Jumanji fighting back in. Definitely doesn't want to go out now. There's a lot of killers there in losers bracket. I think Kakoma as well. Oh no, he's losing to John. Oh, the flash opens the jacket on him. Uh -huh. Take it to the wall. Oh, unblockable. Ah. Let's him take. Yeah, I think Can there's two moves already there that you know he didn't use before. The flash, super important, mm -hmm. and the unblockable too. Also, the, I'm glad you said that. That flash is definitely something that you can use against you know standing jabs, even shoulders. Right. 
And already playing a lot stronger here. But we've seen this before. We've seen exactly how this works out. Tries oh. to get out of there, but breaks the throw. He's still out of there. Oh, but he stays on the wall. And another shoulder to close it out. And look the, at the pop-off. The, 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 the problem with the shoulder, again, you know, we're talking about, you know, using it, you know, if the opponent's not punching, but it's mental damage. Yeah. You're like thinking, oh my god, now why am I getting hit by the shoulder all the time? And he didn't punish it that time. That's what I'm talking about, Steve. Yeah, no, that's exactly what it is. Okay, now you need the bank on carrying right now to get to the other st side of the little stage. That wall, oh, real close in the stage. Step on him. Looking for a duck right there. Wow, the sidewalk actually got him out of the full range of the oh, move back. I, one I actually, into shoulder. I actually want to stand up and clap for Chicken Mario. Wow. I want to go up to him and be like, you are crazy. How can you be this good Bro, and shoulder. not play the game? Mm -hmm. It's all about knowing the mindset of the person that you're playing against, right? You got to sprinkle in that uh, that mental warfare. Yeah, exactly. It's all about the brain here. And Jumanji, back against the wall here. Oh, my God. Oh, uh, okay. Okay. But time. look at this is potentially the last round. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, too late. Like, yeah. It might be too late. It yeah, might yeah. be too late. You have bro. to be on point from round one. No point punishing it there. And then losing Chicken Morrow.